Hi guys, or should I say again, ladies? Uh, this is your old depressed collapsitarian doomsday, doomsday lonely heart out here wrapping up another day here in the garden and the uh, peach orchard and. We've been getting the taters in today and planting the the wildflowers and the butterfly and the hummingbird bushes and whatnot. And uh, here it is Thursday morning, now Thursday afternoon. I'm just cloudy but warm Thursday afternoon, uh, February 15th, 2018, the day after. Uh, Valentine's Day and uh, anyway another Valentine's Day has come and gone and oh boy anyway I'm not gonna drag this one out uh, I for <laughs> somehow through it all and I might have to I haven't decided whether or not to share the uh, the Valentine the Valentine that was waiting for me this morning from from uh, the only woman I've heard of from that uh, went on my my personals ad over there on Vimeo.com and bit shoot so it really is funny but I uh, haven't decided because I'm I'm trying to keep my sense of humor about this, ladies, but I know that you're out there. Your old depressed, collapsitarian, doomsday organic farmer knows that somewhere listening to this video is, uh, is a woman that, that wants what Hambone Little Tail has to offer, and I don't mean just the little dog. Although Sancho Panza does come along, it's somewhere out there, uh, there there is a woman who appreciates. Uh, there's probably only one out of a out of a population of three and point eight billion women on this planet, but one of them uh, wants what I have to offer, and I want what she has to offer. I know you're out there, darling. Uh, you know, how many thousands and thousands of videos, books, magazine articles, whatnot, have I read since I moved down here into the Doomosphere uh, nine years ago? You know, with all of these people, uh, women and men, talking about one of two things, either either simplifying their lives and, you know, buying a little farmhouse uh, out in the country, uh, move to the country, plant you a garden, eat a lot of peaches, you know, uh, I know there's a woman out there who, who wants A, that, which I have to offer, or B uh, wants to get out there and travel and, and, and get out there and have some adventures while we still can. Get out here and see this beautiful world. Uh, you know, over and over and over again. Uh, I, I think what this channel, what 50% of this channel is all about is completely escapes. Uh, folks attention with with all of the joking around that I do about uh, relationship troubles and whatnot and I, I, I'm, I'm still convinced that there is some woman out there who understands from this point forward that all we can do is get out there and enjoy it while we still can uh, it, it it's planting a garden getting your hands down in the dirt Growing, growing a garden, uh, playing acoustic music, dancing around the fire, um, you, you know, and getting out there and hitting the highway while we still can. Uh, 
So anyway, for some reason, I continue to play this game because, you know, nine years uh, of doing this alone, uh, and it's been a hell of a, you know, it's been a long, strange trip, and I've enjoyed it, but I am ready for some female company to join me on this. And so either all of these hundreds, thousands of, of books and videos and whatnot talking about simplifying your life and whatnot are, and, and that there's people who apparently want to do this are just total bullshit. Or, uh, you know, because I sure as hell did not have this problem uh, when I was a clueless moron real estate uh, agent and house flipper making $100,000 a year. I did not have the problem in, in Austin, Texas, trying to uh, trying to find a woman, uh, a that uh, I had any interest in, and B had any interest in me. It's amazing how uh, from the day that I made this decision to uh, walk away from Empire, to have the fucking balls. You know, to walk away from that horse shit that we all talk about. That, that, you know, I took the damn yoke off my neck. I walked away from it, ladies. Yeah, and see what it got me. It got me nine years uh, of sitting around with my thumb up my ass and my dick in my hand. Uh, you know... Yeah, it's depressing as hell. So anyway, I'm going to be here in, in this very cool little farmhouse. Sancho Ponza and I, we are going to be here for springtime in Austin. South by Southwest Music Festival's coming up. It's absolutely going to be beautiful weather. The garden's going to be growing. and uh, Music's going to be playing. And... Uh, so I'm, gonna, I'm right here. I'm not that hard to find. I'm really not that hard to find. Uh, so anywho, Sancho Panza says, come find us. Come find us and bring your little dog. Because Sancho wants a little dog to play with. That's my little soulmate here. He says, you can bring me a little dog to play with too, like that. So, all right, ladies, there it is. It's all yours. Come get it. And then uh, come this summer, we're going to hit the road here in Texas, and we're going to take a long trip. We're heading to all up north and east, upstate New York, New England, eastern Canada. We're going to have us a road trip. And... Uh, there you go. You know what you're getting into with with Hambone. I do have a uh, sometime inappropriate sense of humor. So uh, as long as you can handle the uh, the the dark, the dark, ironic, satirical sense of humor about seeing nothing. Uh, Nothing to laugh about in the situation, so you damn well better laugh about it. Uh, oh well. Humpty Dumpty Tribe at gmail.com. I'm sending this, uh, seeding the universe one more time, and I know you're listening to this video, and, and, and I know you want to answer it. And I have a pretty good idea who you are. And I'm waiting for your email. And uh, we will see tomorrow when I wake up whether I'm going to share the valentine I got from the from uh, my, my last friend when I met down here in the Doomosphere or not. Goodbye, ladies.